What up, tubers? This is Ray from Rayware Computers since 1996. Got my new YouTube channel. Not too bad. Going okay. You know how it is. A lot of work. Hope you guys are getting some value out of this. If you've been failing out affiliate marketing, you're not alone. Allow me to guide you through all the mistakes I've made and how to recover from them. If you're having a problem getting your affiliate thing going, stop. Go to rwcweb.com. Put your best email in that box, and I will take care of you like my own little hatchling, okay? All right, so if you remember the last video, we went to the web starts, and we made this little sluggers thing here. Now, the back button is great, okay? Back button is great. You know, but say, you, you know, you screwed this up tremendously, okay? And this is the greatest thing about the free stuff. Uh, if it's for free, it's for me. Let's face it. This affiliate marketing thing, these gurus, they tell you all this crap about, you know, uh, making a $1,000 a minute and all this other BS, okay? Don't fall into that, okay? Don't fall into that. It's a lot of hard work gotta have skills a lot of them don't tell you that they went to school for graphic designs and IT and marketing and all that other stuff okay those are the top people doing the top things that's a couple other folks like myself who started back in the day you know we had the edge because we were in there in the beginning okay when basically you know the general populace was still uh, was still stupid to it you know what I'm saying okay so, um, you know, what I want to show you, okay, these private label rights stuff, and it's a lot of information overload. I want to keep giving you information and information and, you know, making it what they call monkey proof, like when they send a monkey to space, you know, they only hit a couple of finite buttons, okay? You want to take the time, okay, get stuff on paper in the real world, uh, do your research on what you're going to do, okay? Learn about the people that you're going to be projecting to, okay? You got to learn about your audience because in marketing, again, and I said it in my other videos, marketing, my opinion doesn't mean a thing. As much as I like to think it does, it doesn't, okay? So now with these private label rights, okay, and uh, I'll leave the links in the description, of course. And of course, I want you to like and subscribe and sign up to my newsletter and all that great stuff, okay? Um, all right, I'm not really seeing anything. Oh, there goes some baseball stuff. Let's see what they got here. Okay. Yeah, it's the 4th of July. It's getting a little late for the old man, okay? Now, these are probably... Uh, I don't think I'm signed into my paid account here. Okay. Um, let's see, this is probably the page. Okay, for in order for me, let's see, is this a freebie? All right, so there's the squeeze page. Now, with this, remember, this is a squeeze page that's online, okay? We're visiting their website, so you don't want to copy and paste this stuff like this, okay? You do not want to copy and paste this stuff like this, okay? Anything that you see here, even even if it's valid information, it's on a website somewhere. And if you don't have original content, I cannot stress this enough. If you do not have original content on your websites, oh, big Fourth of July. I'm actually sounds like a motorcycle doing it. Okay, sorry for the interruption. Okay, if but if you do not have original content on your website minimum per page 500 words of original content you will not even get recognized on the organic traffic now if you want to pay for traffic through you know Facebook good luck with that you know you get banned for you know writing a wrong letter on that right and making and putting a wrong picture on there or mentioning Donald Trump you'll get thrown off of there in a second okay uh, Amazon affiliate program 
you don't make three sales within 180 days you say goodbye to them you have to keep re-signing up so do your homework do your research on this stuff okay it's a lot entails you, you, you gotta you gotta educate yourself on this okay you know or you, you can go to school go to a school somewhere you can watch my videos okay but I'm here to teach you how to do your websites properly okay now I'm a big big fan of, of, of web starts okay I'm a big fan of them let's go over here I think I, I think I, I just deleted that stuff okay I'm gonna go back to it all right well I didn't save it okay so say you know you, you, you you deleted this stuff by accident okay and it was a lot of stuff or you just went through and this is gonna happen you're gonna go through stuff like crazy you're gonna have a pile and pile and pile of stuff like crazy okay I can show you a list of 200 domain names that I, that I bought in five years you know that I, I tried it and it didn't work and I gave up the main reason why I failed with it is because I gave up okay that's the main reason why I failed. And you have to understand that. You can't give up on how much you're failing. Okay. And and you have to what you have to do is you have to uh you know, like again, my opinion doesn't matter. It's my audience opinion that matters in anything that you do, okay? And and you have to be serious and treat it like a, a real business, okay? So there there are definitely places to get original content okay there's places you can get original content okay but again oh, got a phone call coming in be right back all right little glitch with the phone thing there that was the little woman calling to see how I was doing okay she's down the road at her daughter's house I'm here trying to make you guys have a great business and a great website okay now where was I with this content for your website okay you always want it to be original so what you could do okay like here's a baseball look at this these are articles now this is a new guy here this is master resell rights dot com okay and I'll leave a link in the description and although honestly I don't think they have any free stuff here okay but come on you know look at this a dollar 69 okay now the way you do some of your research I want to show you how to do some research right click okay search Google for that image okay that's one way oh it came up with the paint thing all right so that's that's a crude way of doing it but you if you have a, a more specific thing but also okay let's take this article here and let's search the article okay 25 learn baseball article okay learn baseball articles okay all right, so it's, it came up on another PLR site. Now, what people do is what they allow you to do. Like, you can literally take this and make it your own private label rights thing. Okay, this looks kind of crude. Okay, so let's go back. All right, let's go back. Okay. Of course we're seeing it where it origin from okay and you, and you have to you have to do your research like this okay you have to okay let's see what this guy has to do with anything okay I'm baseball I've got an old eBay account okay they kind of changed the picture on it and everything they're selling it for five bucks Okay, so let's go back to where we got it from. All right. All right, so now even if I took all this text here and I right clicked and I did a search, okay, it's going to come up all over the place because now that's not original text. Gabish, kids understand, you got to have original text, all right? 
There we go. All right. See, so that's what I'm talking about. Another way to do it is, like, let me bring up this old eBay account I got over here. Okay. Uh, let's go to eBay. All right. We'll go right to their top dog there. Okay. And we'll go over here. And again, we'll search for the title. All right. As you can see, nobody's putting that 25 in there, but they're not fooling the old DOS geek. Okay. But let's see what we got. All right, so you 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 want to go do this, okay? All right, so they're showing it all as reseller rights, okay? Let me get that out of there because that kibosh the search. All right, so eBay is a good thing. Amazon is a good way to search it out as well, okay? But you're gonna want to do your research on it, okay? Before you pick your thing. So there's a lot of places that you can get articles okay and what you can do is you know you're gonna have to read through them you can't be lazy with it I'm the laziest guy in the world okay now the thing I was telling you about web starts as well when you're creating your websites and back up everything back it up do it now do it now why don't you have a backup what are you do not have a backup Make your backups, backup, 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 three times, okay? All right, and check your links. When you're doing these affiliate marketings, check your damn links, okay? Check your links, check your links, check your links. What are you going to do? You're going to check your links, okay? So now, one of the reasons why I love web starts, okay, so much is that if you kibosh this thing, and you screw it up okay and it usually happens because you know you get angry you get frustrated my biggest problem is even when I was younger okay especially when I was younger uh, my biggest problem is uh, that I worked all hours of the day no matter how tired I was okay no matter what things I had to do in the real world I push myself and push myself and push myself two things you're gonna to want to stay healthy okay and you're gonna to wanna to, uh, get your rest okay get your rest and I'm doing too much on this old computer and it's crapping out on me let me shut some stuff down okay let me shut these things down you want to work clean, you want to work neat, okay? And now I'm embarrassed. So I'm doing too much, okay? So let's give this a preview. Oh, that's nice. I huh? see. You can take that, okay? Hold on for one sec. All right, well, try that again. Mouse got a little stuck there, working my computer like a dog. Okay, so this is a nice article, and you could take this, and I'll have some videos on this because this really is important to your website as well. Uh, my main thing is I'm teaching you how to do the websites. Okay, all right, so let's go back. Okay, so this loaded up. So again. You want to back things up. You want to make sure you do your research on your audience as well as your product and be very picky about who you represent. You know, in a lot of the, 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 uh, the, even on ClickBank, you know, uh, a lot of the companies crapped out on me that was supposed to be great products and they made millions of dollars on. And I go ahead and I build my niche site around it. And the next thing you know, they're gone, which means you're gone. Okay. So, and then now some of them, uh, they're being very picky about who, even on ClickBank, you know, you got to get approved. Okay. By them. So be very picky. Be very picky with whose product 
you're going to try and push. So, yeah, they're going to pay you, but you're doing all the work. Okay, so you be per particular about who you do business with. And me personally, I don't do business with anybody that won't do business with me. You understand? See how that works? Remember, you're in business now. You got to start thinking like a business person. You got to you got to stop thinking like an employee. Okay, words of wisdom here. Okay, so this is the old Das Geek. Okay, this is, you know, it can be it can be really bad. Okay, and I have to say, when I first started this, you know, I failed tremendously, and you know, I already had a thriving computer service business going. Okay, uh, and 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 I had a lot of money, but I didn't want to dump money into it and waste money. But I'm not going to lie to you. You know, I lost over ten thousand dollars, fifteen thousand dollars in the beginning because I was shoveling money into it. And I said, "Whoa, hold the phone here." Okay, I missed my window because I didn't start doing the affiliate thing back in the day. Okay, but you know, once I got into it, I said, "Oh, I got money to do this." Boom, and then the the, the affiliate product was gone, okay, or I get banned from Facebook, I get banned from this, I get banned from that, you know, and I'm like, holy shit, I just spent all this money on advertising, and now I got nothing, and now all the money's gone too. So if it's for free, it's for me, okay, because when I started doing with the free stuff, I was able to make mistakes and make mistakes and make mistakes and hardly feel a thing, okay. I just went over it the other day how recently in the past two years, how I spent over two thousand dollars on on domains and setting them up and doing that, and they charge you for email, which is a crock of crap. There, okay, uh, you know, and most of those websites are gone now. Even now, with all my experience, so don't get sucked into that vortex. Don't go down that rabbit hole of spending and spending and spending, especially if you can't afford it. Okay, spend it. You want to spend some good money on it. And this is what they tell you, too, that you don't need an education to do this. That's total crap bullshit coming out of their mouths. And it should be legal, okay? It should be legal. Uh, it's crap. You need your education. Whether you're self-educated like myself, there's a lot of guys like me that are self-taught, okay? So in the beginning, there was no computer science courses in the colleges on the East Coast in New Jersey, okay? You know, so... Educate yourself. Don't listen to them. If you got money to spend, go to school. Spend it on school. Web design, whatever you need to do. You understand? Marketing. Okay? So, this is the old DOS Geek. Okay? I'm going to ask you to like and subscribe on my YouTube channel. Okay? Because I really want to teach you guys how to do this. I really do. Okay? Take care.